stroke them like cats. Hi everyone, George here, and today I am at one of the largest aquarium stores in England. This is Maidenhead Aquatics at St Albans, and I wanted to show you around. Really hope you enjoy the journey. If you do enjoy it, hit that thumbs up button, subscribe if you haven't already, and leave me a comment which is your favourite fish. So let's go and take a look around. So the store is absolutely massive. Uh, it's part of a big kind of retail estate and I'll show you in more detail of how big it is when you look at their, their dry goods area. Let's take a look at their pond stuff to start with. It's coming to the end of pond season now in the UK. We're in September and traditionally this is when the kind of pond season finishes but still some great plants available as you can see check out those pond plants lots of individual cold water fish vats here we've got goldfish tench all different sizes ghost koi or chibunkins absolutely incredible selection for pond plants and they do actually do some really high quality Japanese koi as well. We really would love to have a pond at home, but my garden isn't big enough, unfortunately. So back into the store, and they do have some beautiful koi. And then there's like a rehome section here where they've got some huge koi in here. I think there's a sturgeon in there as well. Let's see if we can. Check out these bruises. See the size, size of these fish. You actually stroke them like cats. So yeah, you can get an idea of how big the place is. They've even got their own coffee shop. So if you're a fish keeping widow or widower, you can come and get a coffee while your other half goes and geeks out at all the fish, etc. If you want to buy a new aquarium, this is the place to come. There's so many to choose from. Pretty incredible. And actually, there's a scape that I set up here probably about three years ago. Aquascaper 1500, still looking pretty good. Got Kessel lighting there. Uh, lots of rainbow fish. All looking really mature and colourful and then we can walk into the actual main kind of livestock area so the first thing you're greeted with is this huge fish only system here home to a huge selection of tangs these Achilles tangs here and then check out the size of this excuse the reflections matter tank See if we can get a better picture. There it is. Gorgeous. So he's massive, you can see how big he is by the size of my hand. So many tangs in here powder blue tangs, yellow tangs. There's an emperor angel just in the centre of the screen right now. So let's take you through some of the. There's a, a freshwater display here, it's quite attractive. Got some Odessa barbs in there, rosy barbs. Very nice. And then I think there's about 300 tanks here, all freshwater tropical. So all your bread and butter stuff, all your different tetras. I won't go through each tank because I'll be here all day. Some betters as well. So many tanks. Livestock's really healthy, and it's just great to see a big store like this doing really well. I've been chatting to the staff and getting their story, and they're just really passionate. They're really keen on the fish welfare and and, and taking the customer on a journey. You know, they think this is really important. You know, online is all well and good for learning stuff, but 
actually having a, a physical relationship with a store I think is, is also really important. Check out the goldfish, so many. It's an absolutely amazing selection of fish. Some real odd balls here as well. Wild red hook. I think there's a super rare piranha as well. Here we go. Cerasalmus gearai. Check out this guy here. Put the markings on this. Gold nuggets. Well caught. Beautiful. African cichlids. So they've got. This is like the tap water section. All this lot is is tap water, which is very hard. And then there's these kind of central bays are reverse osmosis, so soft water. And then you've got another uh, reef display here. It's looking really nice. And then more fresh water all the way along here. So it's about another 300 tanks here. And then we've got the marine section here. So sorry about the blue lighting. Uh, but they've got coral frags, LPS, SPS, softies, and then all of the marine fish as well. That is harlequin tusk fish here. Beautiful. And then the freshwater plant section. So they're using Denalay plants here. Good to see. Uh, some aquafleur as well. But lots to choose from, all looking healthy. Excellent. Now I've got some more betters here. And just another angle of the tropical section, freshwater tropical section. And then dry goods galore, frozen food. They've got everything here, from pond to high-end reef stuff, so really great store thanks so much to the guys for letting me film here i was to come on a on a weekday where it's not too busy and yeah if you're in the area st albans maidenhead aquatics do check it out more than likely going to find something that you're interested in okay guys there you go a tour of maidenhead aquatics st albans really hope you enjoyed it uh, amazing store so big something for everyone. So you take care, keep on escaping. Cheerio. Hi everyone, George here. And today I am at Maidenhead Aquatics in Cruise Hill in London. I'm with my friend, where is he? James Star Marshall. He was uh, part of a Meet the Scaper episode, which I did quite recently. And uh, I want to show you around. It's a really great store, very new. It's only been open for two months. So let's take a look around. So we walk in and the first thing we see is a couple of nice scapes here. Fluval Flex here on the right, 57 litre. And the Fluval Spec on the left. Really great to see some healthy planted tanks. And I wanted to bring your attention to this scope here. Absolutely love this. Uh, so it's an EA Freshwater. I think this is a 900, so it's three feet long or 90 centimetres long. And I just... It's just so simple, but the fish selection is amazing. These pentazona barbs with their vertical stripes really match this plant here. This is a Cryptocryne aponogitensis, I think, which is a super rare plant. They've imported it especially from Poland, apparently. And, oh, this is a plant that some of you may recognise. This is Schismatoglottis praetoi. So very new to the hobby. You've got some Bucophalandra here. Uh, no liquid fertilizers, no nutrition in the substrate, just plain gravel. And just shows you how easy it can be to create a really nice scape. So like I said, brand new store, but I've only been open two months. Nice and clean, loads of dry goods, loads of aquariums to choose from. I love this hardscape here. Check out the fine textures of this wood here. All this detail fine textures that you can use and maybe some nanoscapes, look really nice. Really good selection of hardscape materials. These are becoming really popular with these kind of fruit crates. A aquascaping kind of friendly dry goods area here with all the fertilizers, substrates, etc. Plant 
storing facility here with the traditional kind of cascade system, LED lighting. And this is the, the Cryptochorini that was on about earlier from that display tank. Cryptochorini upon a Gitafolia and Eustriana. Uh, but yeah, super healthy, really great to see the store focusing on the aquascaping products. So, some more livestock here, some guppies. Main, ah, here we go, There's some more of the Schismateglottis here. Awesome plant, watch out for that, it's gonna be the next trending plant, I would say. So, classic kind of aquascaping friendly fish. Cardinal tetras, Colombian tetras, these are beautiful. Red eye tetras. More tetras here, blue tetras, these are pretty. They're quite active, quite fast swimming tetra, these ones. Ah, lamp eyes, gorgeous. Never actually kept these before in escape. Penguin tetras. So all fresh water. Nice to see a lot of decor being used in the, in the tanks. Black ghost knife fish as well. Never kept these before myself. Really love this kind of styling. Super modern. A little bit different to your traditional maiden head aquatics. Then you've got discus as well. Driftwood, awesome. And then my favorite piece of decor ever, Sunken Galleon. Okay guys, there you go. Just a very quick tour of the Maidenhead Aquatics here at Cruise Hill in London. Do check it out if you're in the area. Very much aquascaping, friendly store, great fish, great plants, and great displayscapes. You take care, keep on scaping. Cheerio.